Alright, the name of this one is Charles Stretch Verdicchio invented the most amazing chicken dish ever. It's called Chicken Savoy, and yes, it was made, invented here in New Jersey. They, you can go buy it right now at the Belmont Tavern. Hold on, let's see if we go down a little. On Bloomfield Ave in Bloomfield, New Jersey. Now, here. This is Stretch when he was younger with Joe DiMaggio. This is what the Belmont Tavern looks like. Beautiful establishment. Not like a five-star restaurant. Go in there to everybody's picture. Who's famous is on the walls? Who ate there? If you're somebody, you want to get your picture up on that wall. The Pope ate there. This is what Chicken Savoy looks like. They do it on chicken. The chicken pieces are cut up. Here's what it looks like when it comes out of the oven. The recipes. There's all kinds of recipes out here. You'll see this recipe. It's got red wine. Chicken Savoy doesn't have red wine only. It has balsamic vinegar. It has a little red wine vinegar. I know that because my Uncle Mike got the recipe from him years and years ago. My father and his Uncle Mike used to go there all the time. Hey, we're going to the Belmont. Always got cut, cut line. Always got sat down. If there's a line at the door, they always got in. So, Uncle Mike got the recipe from him. Oh, that one's a duplicate. Here's another recipe. Chicken thighs, legs, and breasts cut up, split in half. Three, four cloves of garlic. As I, If you watch my video, you can never have enough garlic. Some dried oregano, olive oil. If you're cooking it in one of these pans, this new technology that nothing sticks, A, you don't need any oil at all. B, when you have oil on the chicken, guess what? It prevents the chicken from absorbing the balsamic vinegar. Now, this isn't the real recipe. The real recipe has some balsamic and it has the red wine vinegar. There you notice there's no thyme here. The only thing that's missing in this recipe is the pepper. You got to put pepper in it. Some recipes you're going to see, they have salt. Why would you add salt to something Look, salt and pepper to taste. No, you overdo the pepper. This is what makes it the chicken savoy. They put extra pepper in it. I like a lot of pepper when I do mine. And lots and lots of extra garlic. This one's got chicken stock. There's no chicken stock in chicken savoy. Come on. This one, no red wine vinegar. And it's got only three, table three tablespoons. you got to be kidding me. All right. That was my video. Hey, Stretch, if you happen to watch this, look how I did it. It was key. It was better than my father used to make. It went from my uncle to my father. I grew up eating it. Been in your restaurant. Loved it at your restaurant. Eh, my father kind of made it a little bit better than you did. But you're a restaurant. You're there to make money. I get it. We used a higher quality balsamic vinegar. You know, he used the recipe that you gave Uncle Mike or my uncle. All right, and they're using right here, look, organic boneless skinned chicken breasts. Whole chicken cut into pieces. So all these recipes that are out there, if you look at what I put up there and you make it the way I make it, it is unbelievable. Oh, yeah, Stretch, I want to thank you for giving it to my Uncle Mike and getting it to my father. Love you.